if you are looking to monitor your home temperature for four dollars this video is for you in this video i will show you how to connect a xiaomi thermometer to esp32 using esp home then we will see how to monitor the temperature using home assistant before starting let's take a look on the requirements four dollar xiaomi thermometer with bluetooth esp32 chip with bluetooth and wi-fi you can buy all these materials in the link below and if you like this video please subscribe and give a like in order to configure a xiaomi thermometer we need to generate a bind key for it on your smartphone go to the link appearing on the screen turn on bluetooth and location then click on the connect button at the top left of the page when a pop-up appears choose the name of your thermometer now wait until the status is connected then click on do activation button wait for a while and then the bind key should appear on the screen so this is the bind key we should use in our configuration of ESP home in this video I will run ESP home on my computer using docker you can find all the code and the configuration on my blog once the container is up you can check that ESP home page is appearing on localhost 6052 now create the configuration file livingroom.yaml and add the configuration written on my blog the configuration contains the Wi-Fi name and password it activates logging API and it contains a Xiaomi configuration here you should add the MAC address of your thermometer and the bind key we have already generated before once you have created the configuration go to ESP home web page click on validate to ensure that the configuration is good then on the top of the page choose USB then click upload now ESP home will compile the code and the configuration and flash it on ESP32 home assistant it is a private IOT hub that you can install on your computer or on a Raspberry Pi and enjoying access to your sensors run home assistant on your computer go to the web page on the left menu click on configuration then integrations now click on the plus button on the bottom right and search for ESP home add the IP address of ESP32 already configured and you should see the data of the sensor you can install the mobile application and configure it using the external home IP address to access to all the sensors data on your mobile phone